Baird is, you know, oftentimes regarded as the sort of the comedy element, but he really is a voice of reason and really, you know, like all the other characters, really detests being in this hell and is very vocal about it. The rhythm, I just imagine him just being very kind of quick-witted and just thinking about, like, what, what are we going to do? Oh, that's great. Oh, we have to go in. Oh, really? We got to go in. That's just, that's just fantastic. Great. All right. What are you going to do? You know, that kind of thing. There we go. One muscled queen. Not you, her. You were great. I loved your, your speech there, especially with the bitch-ass stuff. Very good. Very enlightening. Acting in a video game, on one end, it's the basic acting uh, skills that you are required to do on stage or on film. What's different in a video game is you have many outcomes. So instead of a regular script, you're playing ten different endings. More, maybe. And so you have to really know that character very well. How will he be when he's about to die? How is he killing? How is he running away? How is he relaxed? And you have to have all these parts of him very complete. So then the player, who's as integral to it as I am, uh, you know, is going to elicit different responses from me. So what's fun for me uh, is having players, you know, game players, gamers come to me and say, hey, you know, you were, uh, we, were, you know, played Gears of War with you all weekend. You were a real a-hole or you were a real jerk. You know, and then someone else can come to me and say, wow, you were funny. That was really funny. And I realized it all depended on how they played and how they interacted with me.